If a picture is worth a thousand words, this speaks volumes. The South Carolina flag with nine doves representing the Charleston victims. The image appears on the Blue and White Friday Unity Facebook page, which attracted thousands of comments. Caroline Bell wrote, I am ashamed of one person, and I am proud of many in this state. At Twitter, hashtag Charleston Strong, the picture of a heart-shaped human tribute was a popular retweet. Doesn't get much better than this, went one comment. From a Christian group in the United Kingdom, the image of Emmanuel AME Church and the tweet, Pray for Charleston. On the Twitter page for DoSomething.org, you'll find a virtual poetry slam about racism. Don't have people judge you from the color of your skin. Tell them to look within. On Instagram, an image that quickly went viral, two hands, one black, one white, form a heart, and the message, hate won't win. In Myrtle Beach, people at the Roasted Bean Coffee Shop were talking about the social media response to the Charleston shooting. What they liked about it was the outpouring of unity and how people turned an act of hate into an act of love. I mean, he did it, killed nine people, tried to start a race war, and I mean, they just, they weren't having it. it that's not what they wanted. But some aren't sure Facebook or Twitter are the right places for this conversation. One young woman says a tweet or picture doesn't change the outcome. I think face-to-face -face change and like showing love to this generation has a bigger impact than social media.